wish Arnaldo Mesa all the very best. He might just need it here against Arnaldo Mesa. Mesa, in fact, got to the quarterfinals of the World Championships last year. But 1991, he was a bronze medalist in the World Championships in Sydney. Eight stone, seven pounds. Round one. So this Cuban in the blue. Southport, as you can see. And look at instantly, Jim, the different approach to this sport. The Cuban nice and cool, moving smoothly. Well, I, I think Raheem has got to be a bit intimidated, Steve, when you're facing the Cuban. Yes, we've already lost one American to the Cubans, and that was an absolutely fantastic fight. The hard push to beat that, I think. And uh, that was a little micro, of course, of Cuba. Cuba's oh. giving away an awful lot of body, but he's got fast hands, and Raheem is going to have trouble getting close, I think. And of course, they can do no wrong here in this hall. These Americans, and as you said before, Jim, the Americans are not taking too kindly to the Cubans, but uh, that rivalry just makes this, this competition that much more intense, doesn't it? It makes it more intense, but I, I still think, uh, in the name of sportsmanship, I think the Cubans ought to be cheered. I, 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 I don't like that, when they're just arbitrarily booed simply because they're Cubans. That's not right. And this Cuban, 28 years of age, one of... Uh, Quite a few shop-worn Cubans, I think, we've got here this year in the Olympic Games, and which is why, you know, when we were checking out the uh, the possibilities in this competition, you know, we haven't always gone for the Cubans to win gold. No. You know, some are right to be taken, aren't they? I agree with that, Steve. But I you think can never write them off. I, I think you? Cuba is living on its uh, on its past glories. Well, that's interesting. Raheem well, negative through with the right hand, but very clumsily. Oh, Whoa, good, shot. good shot. Oh, right on it. Lovely long oh, off. He, he's, boy, uh, he's in, in trouble. trouble. He's a wobbler. And uh, well, Zahir Rahim takes a long left cross from this Cuban Mesa. And uh, well, if Mesa does win this one, he will face the Frenchman, Bueta, in the next round. Once again, that left hand lands. Well, we're looking at the, the verge Mesa's here. Mesa's got heavy hands, Steve. Yep. Yeah. And the sa standing count now. The mandatory standing count against Rahim. He's going to continue. Oh, it's all over. It's finished. So a first oh. round win. I don't think, I think that, that was, was a first stoppage. That was premature. Well, that's, uh, I hope we're not going to get a Look 60 minute sit Look at the kid. He's prostrate with yeah, grief. He's, he's terribly no. upset. He shouldn't have stopped it, Steve. No, I agree with you, Jim. Okay, that's not the round. There was only 45 seconds to survive, and that's a terrible shame, I think, for Raheem. But, you know, no doubt about the man who's going to win the fight, but uh, we don't like the way he did it. He did it. This kid, Steve, survived the terrible streets of Philadelphia. Nine years old, he had to carry a gun to school, and he deserved, he deserved more than this, Steve. The ref could have watched it closely, obviously, but I think it was premature. So another Mesa then goes, oh, well, that's terribly unsporting of this American. It certainly is. He won't even shake hands, so we don't care about him anymore, Jim. That was bad behavior. Well, there's the American leaving the arena. He refused to shake hands with Arnaldo Mesa, his conqueror. Well, I think that was very immature, Jim. You know, any sympathy we might have had for him prior to that, I'm afraid, has disappeared now. Well, I always am going to have sympathy for the kid, but I'll tell you something. He could have gone out. There, he could have gone out there like a man. He should have had character. He should have had character. Well, the crowd's still booing as uh, Mesa leaves the hall, and that's a shame. He was the, he was the winner, no doubt about that. Boy, Mesa can hit with that left, Steve. Yeah. Well, I wonder how the Frenchman will feel at the hands of Mesa in the next round. 